guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Jackie Lina. Jackie, 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 Jackie. I am here, flesh in the blood, looking like a yellow highlighter. Cause I don't know, it's a look. Don't be judging me. Like I was just in the mood. Neon is currently my favorite color of the season. So anyway, you can come here for that. I'm rambling. Today you are here because this look, get into it. Oh, is this sultry? Today I'm gonna be doing a get ready with me. I'm going out to eat. I don't know if I should do it after the night. Like I don't know how far tonight's experience is gonna go, but basically I'm gonna show you how to get from basic. Not that there's anything wrong with basic to baddie. I'm gonna show you how to get this look using the new Ignited palette from NARS. It's honestly a banger. Like it really is a banger, I'm not just saying that. This actually is one of my favorite palettes that has launched this month and it's awesome. I'm gonna show you how I've been creating some cute looks with it. Without further ado, I'm already about 20 minutes late to this dinner. Uh, Let me go ahead and get into the look, but first, okay. Scoots forward, okay. Let's talk about the important things. All right, subscribing, number one, all right, hitting that bell notification so that you never miss new uploads because the real tea is, you know you always watch my videos, so you might as well join the family. I'm not gonna judge, I'm not gonna ridicule you. If anything, I'm gonna be appreciative. I would love to see you come back to future uploads and we always love new family members. So make sure you hit that subscribe button so you never miss new uploads and let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna prime my face using the NARS. You know, this Pour and Shine Control Primer has become quite the rare commodity lately. I can't find her in Sephora.com anymore. What happened? We are going to dot that in the middle of my face. I'm just gonna rub that into my skin. I'm gonna take a bit of my Skin Tune Blur Pop Off Pores. I'm just gonna concentrate this as I normally do towards the center of my face and excuse me, I'm filming. I'm gonna rub a bit of that in. Goodbye pores. So it's cold now in LA, officially cold. Mm -hmm. I see what she's trying to do, I see her. So what I like to do is fake a highlight from within. I've been doing this a lot lately in my most recent videos. I know you probably have peeped it. I like to take a cream highlighter or a liquid highlighter and you know, do my thing under the foundation. One of my favorites, actually I have two favorites, South Beach from NARS and Puerto Vallarta from NARS. Puerto Vallarta is really a banger. This is just kind of that really beautiful, look how stunning that is. And it's really easy. I just kind of like smack myself in the face with it. I take advantage of the round shape to really kind of blend itself out. You know, this whole like getting dark at 3 p.m. thing is just not gonna work for me. So if we could just fast forward to like June, that'd be wonderful. Like Christmas, I'm gonna let you finish, but like I'm really feeling some type of way about like this year just flying by in front of my eyes. What did I do to deserve this? But anyway, I just like doing this to just kind of, you know, add a fun little twist to the base. And you can like really make it stand out because you're gonna put foundation on it anyway. So don't try to be too perfect. My Rockstar foundation combination has been Sheer Glow and Natural Longwear, what is it called? Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation. I use them together, both in the shade Macau. I go for like three-ish pumps of Natural Radiant Longwear. And then I'll add like one pump of Sheer Glow. Sheer Glow is definitely a more full pump. And then I just dot it on. I don't use all four pumps total, but I just like to have that extra security blanket. So as of an hour ago, I really did not have plans today. And then Angel hit me up and invited me to go to dinner with him at Catch. So this just kind of became a get ready with me, spend the evening with me. I haven't really done one of those in a long time. I like when there's like makeup and the vlog together. I like the togetherness of it all. It's just fun to take you guys with me and like have you kind of see, you know, like a day in the life of me, like on the days that I actually shower and do things. Make sure you get that neck, honey. What that neck do? Somebody! Don't forget about your hairline, honey. What lace? Hashtag that one right there. Don't neglect her. I'm still ugly, but whatever, let's move on. So my trio for highlighting, contouring, and like spot treating are all Radiant Creamy Concealers. They did not ask me to place as many NARS products. You guys just know I'm a fiend, I'm an addict, okay? So there's no denying that. We're not gonna deny that on a normal day. So I use a mom under my eye, still might be jet lagged from Tokyo. So we're trying to, you know, correct that. Keep that cute. And then we're gonna draw a sunrise on my forehead. This moment in time, it's in your mind at all. Could be me. Blend it around town. I take cacao. Am I saying that right? I take cacao. Hey, cow. Kukui. I use that kind of like, you know, to like spot tree a little bit, just around the mouth. And then of course I contour with Zwark coffee. I ate way too much rice in Tokyo. So if you excuse me, let's go ahead and blend all that out. You know, sometimes when I'm doing my makeup, there's definitely times where I'm just like getting the job done, but you're not like doing it sloppily, but you're just kind of like throwing it on, you know, like whatever. One lash is on the opposite eye. I don't really care. None of my business. I didn't see a damn thing. But to 
day? I don't know. I just feel like taking my time. Actually, speaking of which, how long does it take you guys to get ready? Because I would say on a good, good day, like if I'm really going in, I could get the job done in like an hour and a half. But on a day where I'm rushing and like I need to get the heck out the house quickly, 30 minutes. Like from the time I sit down, my beauty blender's already wet and like I'm actually starting, I could get it done in like 30 minutes. But on a good day, I need like at least like an hour and a half, maybe an hour. And that also counts hair too, cause I'm really cool with my hair. I get my wigs styled. So basically like I just put them on, like I don't even style them anymore. Thank God. And like while I blend this out, I'm just gonna hit the quant a couple of times, AKA hit the spray with the Ole Miss. This is the ultimate hydration. I like to do this while the skin is still setting because it just makes everything nice and movable and a bit easier to blend. Even though I do feel like this concealer reaches its final form once it's really dried down. That kind of is more for like the foundation and all the other surrounding areas. If you really need that six to eight hour glow, you guys, this routine is where it's at. I'm so serious, it lasts all day. Not quite done yet, don't move. <laughs> Make sure you set with translucent powder. I'm gonna take my Beauty Bakery flower powder, better not bitter. Just dip that in my sponge when I dip you dip we dip and set under eye. Less is more with this powder. And then I'm gonna softly press under eye, make sure I get the creases, and then find your cheekbone and build and landscape. Hit them little extra oily areas, girl, right in the corners of my nose and the sides of my cheeks. Ugh. And then I like to put my little security blanket up here for my eyeshadows. What a beautiful blended face. I'm gonna bronze using this Milani Earth Glow Press Powder. I actually get a lot of compliments whenever I use this as a bronzer. It's gorgeous. This Milani Earth Glow just came to do what the girls never thought they could do or ever even imagine. And this is especially helpful with blending the lace. <laughs> lace care is self care. <laughs> Okay, this lens is like amazing for eye looks, but I like using it because I feel like you can see all three of my brain cells. So you know what? I'm gonna just take one for the team, okay? Mm -mm, girl, no, they did not I try to cancel my Postmates. Mm -mm. So for the eyes, we're gonna use the Ignited. Ooh, and the packaging is so gorgeous. And then when you open it, the magic, like you can obviously tell this is well loved, but it's mainly just transition shades and a bunch of really fun, foily, frou-frou, la-la shades. It's already available in stores and online at Sephora. She's 59, Zoolas, cute little quaint. These aren't really glitters. These aren't really shimmers. They're not pearls. It's like all of that infused in one. And some of these can be applied as eyeliners, which I think I'm gonna play around with today. I've never done that, but I already have a backup for this palette like put it that way. So first we're gonna take Sophia, which is this kind of taupey brown shade. Like if you don't wanna do anything else to your face, just pop that into your crease and go on about your day. Maybe add a little shimmer on the lid. But today we're going to be using that in my outer V area. First I'm gonna really pack it on. And this is how I get the color to really look super dark and concentrated. Shy! Do that thing up, mommy make it roll. You see how dark that looks now? I bet you didn't think it was gonna get that dark, did you? Did you, did you, did you, mm -hmm. Next I'm gonna take Nomea, which is this kind of orangey. I would describe that as like a burnt orange, the perfect crease color. Like this isn't a new shade, this is a already existing shade. And I'm gonna pack Nomea around the edges in my crease area and start to fluff that out. And I'm using that to blend around my crease. And when you need to, you can go back to the first color and rejudge because these colors are so close together that they can kind of get mixed in together. And you can take a slightly fluffier brush around the edges and blend it out again. Lots of blending and lots of patience. I'm gonna go back and apply a bit more base for my lid colors. Oh, this is so satisfying. Don't you just love how good the cleaning up process looks? I sure do. We have to go back to Sophia and start reworking that color in the outer corner. Just go back to perfecting her and getting that blend right, honey. I'm gonna move on to Fired Up. This is just like a really pretty 
spicy, mystical, fairy, brownish green color. I love. I will be using her wet because I want her layered up. I want her thick, T-H-I-C-C, -C, thick, okay? And I get best results. When I want to shear this out, I'll just go in one layer. But if I really want her to be shining, 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 you gotta really kind of layer her up. So to get a more foily look, I did sprinkle the brush a bit. She packs on real cute too. Then I'm gonna switch over to Point Noir, which is this really pretty sultry berry shimmer color. And in between where we apply the outer crease color, I'm gonna fill in that pocket with Point Noir for a little dimension. This is another one of my favorite colors from the palette, just the smokiness of it all. The next color we're gonna use has the most extra, like I thought I was extra, but look at the name of this. This color right here, the name is Saint Paul de Venise. <laughs> we're gonna take that color and a flat shader brush. We're gonna apply that in the inner corner in a crescent moon shape. I also wanna apply St. Paul de Venice <laughs> in my brow bone. So I'm gonna pop a little bit of that right up in here. Just a teen, sirs. Don't get too carried away now. I do, however, want some black liner in my waterline. Using a sharp angled brush and going back to Sophia, I'm just gonna clean up along my crease area so that it looks nice and sharp and precise. Now I'm gonna go to another one of my favorite colors in the palette because of its warm spiciness and it's called Fuse. It is a hot copper shimmer shade and we're gonna blend that along the bottom lash line. Right now we're just laying the color on. We are gonna smudge it out, but like just pack it on, okay, dang it, don't ask questions. Sophia, back to my favorite color. We're going to also blend on the outer bottom lash line. And then we shall smudge her out. We're gonna go back to St. Paul de Venise. He's really making a lot of cameos in this video. So I'm gonna add a bit more to the innermost tear duct of my eye to really get it to pop. Now I'm lining the innermost, like really tight top part of my lash line with a black pencil liner. Back to Sophia. Sophia's really putting in overtime. We're gonna use that as a liner. So directly on top of that black, we're going to smoke and smudge this out and upwards. You guys know how I am, no harsh lines. I love a smoky smudge liner. For my lashes, I'm gonna use Lily Lash So Extra Miami, what else is new? Lily Lash has been undefeated this month for me. They've just been like a top contender. And while my lash glue dries, I'll just be here eating my Postmates, thank you. <laughs> now the rest of the face is going to be a splash of color. So I'm gonna take a bright pink blush. This one is Dolce Pink from Milani. She's really cute. This is what I like when I really need my cheeks to stand out a bit. So I'm popping that on for a nice pinky wash of color. Mull it up, mull it up, watch it all fall out. Pull out. And then for the lip, I never thought I would do this, but I'm feeling like pink is really a moment. Like pink really is that girl today. Wait, real quick though, I just need to add a little bit more mascara to get my natural lashes to blend with the full C. I'm gonna spray a bit of my Ole Mist again. Just a little. I'm gonna line my lips with this ColourPop liner. It is I Heart This, a bold fuchsia pink. Looks red on camera. She's definitely not red. I'm gonna pop in a little bit of Puerto Vallarta, not too much. And then for my lips, I'm gonna take Pink Ultraness slash 413, the Lux Trance lipstick from Pat McGrath. And then I'm gonna take a little bit of my Fenty Gloss Bomb in the color Diamond Milk, Diamonds Are Forever. And that is the final look. Okay, so here's my yellow highlighter look expanded. I'm basically just wearing a black jumpsuit. Let me just get all candid with it my own time. So it's a black jumpsuit from LPA, one of my favorite websites for like bodysuits and jumpsuits and little basics and stuff. They're basically like the new American apparel. I wish they were cheaper, but like same vibe. Simple, classic, you know, all that good stuff. The jacket is from IMG. It looks a little washed out because I had to bump the eye, so it's kind of dark. And some neon sneaker match, which are the most comfortable. I'm really not a sneakers girl because your girl can wear heels all day, every day. All day, every day, heels can get it, okay? But I'm trying this thing. We're basically, I'm pretending to be an Instagram 
baddie. And I feel like this outfit does embody the baddie in me, you know? Okay, so I gotta go. Bye, my darling. Whatever the hell you're watching, it's probably really just out of pocket. Bye. See you later. Bye, where you off to? What? I'm not going nowhere. So you're just looking good for no reason. Well, that's what I do. That's Jackie on a culture. Okay. See you later, babe. I'm going to catch nice. with Angel. Okay, cool. Have, Have a fun. great evening, my darling. See how she just does me? She just leaves. Yep. Mm -hmm. That's the way it should be. That's right, mm -hmm. ladies. Empower yourselves in knowing cool. that you can right. run your relationships, okay? You can. I believe in you. So we're at one of my favorite restaurants in LA, Cash. I just ordered an East Coast Cali. So this one is spicy and sweet, but it has salt on the glass. No romaine, honey. No romaine. No arugula. No iceberg. Okay. So what kind of lettuce do you <laughs> None. They're on recall right now, so all lettuce is canceled at the moment. All of it. Mmm. She's hungry. Here, give me your camera. If you mess up my lipstick, what that mouth do? Yes. Mm. I need one of those when I get my hair braided. And that's sweet. They remembered it was Jen's birthday last time she came in. They brought her dessert today because she couldn't have dessert last time. Isn't that so sweet? Happy birthday. Hey. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Oh my gosh, poor baby. What's the time? Poor baby. It's about 10.30, babes. It's late. Poor baby fell asleep. So I'm home now. I have a special guest. I wonder who that could be. <gasps> We're like vlogging each other. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <gasps> I haven't seen you in so long though. Give me a hug. I hug know. First. You look oh so pretty. God. Congratulations. Thank you. There Thank you go. <gasps> Let me do a live unboxing. Let me hold this. Thank you. Oh my god, it's modeling. One million dollars and be so many <laughs> collaboration. I would like to take my mom. And definitely not the president. <laughs> <laughs> open it. Open it. Open. Hell yeah. I did take a peek earlier though. Oh. I saw her online. I was like, oh she cute. Mm -hmm. The visuals though. Like I need to speak to someone's manager about these visuals. 22 Gorgeous. color eyeshadow yes. palette. You it's know like the perfect size. Mm-hmm. $24. Are these highlighters? Uh-huh. This is these a two? nice glitter topper as well ooh. because there's lots of glitter in there. Mm -hmm. Ooh, nice and ooh. Please take a look at the mirror here. Mm-hmm. Mm. Fit your whole face in there. It's very oh. light. Oh yeah. Yes. Oh, look at that. Mm. Little eye topper. Well, there it is. Do with it what you will. I know you're gonna create some bomb Live looks. Right now on bhcosmetics.com. Yeah, Thanks for letting me come by, you guys. Yeah. She, I literally harassed her. It's, it's the so dead good. of the night here. Like, might as well. Come on over. I love having guests. So I was like, mm -hmm. sure. Come. I never got to see your apartment before. I know. It's so I beautiful. Give you a little fun. Dennis is here. He's knocked out. It's, but. So it's beginning to look a lot like. Christmas. All right, y'all. Well, you know what time it is. You know exactly what to do. Okay, if you're new, this is where you're supposed to click the next video. All right, I put it right here. Oh, wait. It's not like I'm late for dinner or anything. It's cool. It's totally cool.